What's up guys, everything Apple Pro here, and wow, what a roller coaster of emotion these past few days for everybody waiting for a jailbreak. In this video, I wanted to talk about the latest news regarding the upcoming iOS 9.3, 9.2.1, and 9.2 jailbreaks. So I just wanna mention, this is not a jailbreak. I will not be showing you where you can find a jailbreak. This is just an update or news, hence in the title. So if you're expecting that, turn back now. But there is some hope for everybody waiting for a jailbreak. And uh, there's quite a bit to talk about. So let me start with uh, iOS 9.3. We should be seeing a release very soon, and that may be a good thing. Maybe a good thing for the timing of this jailbreak. So there are a few new players, and I want you guys to take everything I say beyond this point with a grain of salt. You know, a lot of people are taking this moment right now, this moment of confusion, of uh, new updates, things moving so fast, you know, for their own benefit to release fake jailbreak tools and scam people, you know, just it's, it just doesn't make any sense to me why people would go out of their way uh, to piss everybody off, to confuse them with all these fake jailbreaks and all. But yesterday night, uh, somebody released a fake jailbreak tool, even a video, photos, you know, everything, the likes. And it went around. Everybody's believing that this guy's got jailbreak working on a 9.3. But in truth, it was a fake jailbreak. And this is his Twitter right here. So this guy went out of his way to create a fake jailbreak to prove to the community that so many people fall for fake jailbreaks. Well, you know, in this time when everybody's waiting for a jailbreak, everybody's hopeful, that is, you know, the worst thing you can possibly do. And he was called out by a lot of the big jailbreakers right away. So I thought that was really great of them to let people know ahead of time, uh, don't fall for it. But he went out and said, don't fall for scams or fake jailbreaks. I think it was a cover. You know, he wanted to benefit from this in some way and then used it as an excuse like, hey, hey, I wasn't trying to scam anybody. It was just it was educational, man. It was just a social experiment. But uh, regardless, guys, right now is a time of pure confusion. You know, nobody really knows for certain what's going on. So be very diligent. Follow the big guys. Uh, r slash jailbreak on uh, Reddit is actually, you know, one of the greatest areas to learn about jailbreaks. So Next, there are two new players in the jailbreak game. So this guy, ENMTW, who he is, I really don't know, but he has actually posted uh, screenshots on his Twitter of him running Cydia, of him uh, using the correct kernel version in Cydia. He's proven it and he is running it on iOS 9.3. So what actually made me a little bit more secure in this guy is a comment left by Luca Tedesco on his picture. And Luca Tedesco is basically saying the blue dot on Cydia, uh, he has it too on his jailbreak. And as we know, Luca Tedesco has a working jailbreak for a 9.2, 9.2.1, and 9.3, one we'll never see. And this is basically what he means by the little blue dot, as if you just installed a new app. So that's a good thing. I mean, no one's called him out as fake. And Luca Tedesco has even confirmed that he has the same little thing going on on his 9.3 device. Now, what firmware does it work on? This guy has confirmed it works on 9.2 and up. And one question, he did say he will release it just with a yes. No time frame, nothing, just a yes. I mean, it could be from now till 2020 for all we know, but you know, that's good. Very happy. I would be very glad if this guy was legit. Again, take this with a grain of salt. I do not guarantee it. I'm very skeptical, but when Luca Tedesco himself, you know, comments about something like this, it gives me a little slimmer of hope. And next up, this guy, Josh, apparently he's been around for a while. I don't know anything about him. He's very small time. This is the one I am the most skeptical about. So this guy's claiming he's got a jailbreak on iOS 9.3 beta one. Then he goes ahead and posts a picture of him running on iOS 9.3 beta three already an inconsistency. There's tons of little inconsistencies on his posts and pictures that I'm noticing and I don't like what I see. However, the jailbreak that I want, that hope, you know, I just want to believe. I want to believe so bad, but this guy's got a Twitter and it's full of, you know, this new tool he's building apparently. He says he's going to release it tonight <laughs> and I don't know about that, but if he does, he's going to be our savior. You know, this is huge, huge grain of salt here, guys. I don't believe this. I'm very skeptical. And the last few weeks have made me even more so. But, you know, I just wanted to share that this guy is making some waves in the jailbreak community. He says he's going to be releasing it. He even has a picture of the tool he's building for Windows. He says he's compiling it for Mac as well today. You know, obviously, if we don't see this tonight, fake. But, you know, if you want to check it out, his name is Josh. 
the H4 CKER. Uh, interesting stuff, guys, but jailbreak right now, very uncertain. Everybody's using this time to uh, promote their own jailbreak, social experiments or scams. Be very careful, be diligent, guys. I will keep you updated. I will wake up at 3 a.m. if the jailbreak comes out and post it right away, so stay tuned for anything like that. But if you're uh, skeptical about a jailbreak, whether you want to do it or not, be sure to check out my videos showing you why you should or shouldn't. It's probably a good time to do that right now because uh, we've got so many teams working on a jailbreak right now. It's inevitable. We will see a jailbreak soon, guys. I mean, uh, this is so hard, so hard. This moment of waiting, hoping, but will it be worth it in the end? I hope that iOS 9.3 comes out before a jailbreak. Hopefully these guys don't burn the exploit until 9.3. That's my personal hope, even though it might take a week or two more. Hopefully 9.3 is where the jailbreak comes out on because that might be one of the last firmwares uh, for iOS 9, major ones anyways. Thanks so much for watching guys. Stay tuned for any news or the jailbreak itself. Peace.